That's our logo. Do I mean our what it is? Our what is that called? Jingle. Huh? That's our jingle. Come here, come here, come here. What's happening? That's what's happening. What's happening? What's always happening? Entering what? passcodes for more time is what's always happening. That's what's always happening. You look cute. I love your headband. Thanks. I like it. Jewel, you got some prizes there. I understand. I do. They're prizes for me. I know they're prizes for you. I'm a little sad. I thought I was going to get these prizes too, but I didn't. Do you want to see what they are? I do. I want to see because, and then I want to tell them the story of how this came to be because I think it's hysterical. What you got, there, Jules? Ooh, it's oh. a sensory bin from outer space. Ooh. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, guys! So the other day, like a few weeks ago, we posted a question on Facebook that said, "Am I a bad mom for not having a sensory bin?" And the amount of responses yes. was overwhelmingly wonderful. Everybody's like, no, you're not a bad mom. Don't worry. Do you guys remember that? Do you remember when that was posted? Did you participate in that? Well, anyway, then we got a little email that went like this. Beep, boop, boop, beep, beep, beep. Hey, guys, we have sensory bins. And that's how the whole love started. I know. Yeah. The rest is history. Here's another one. You ready for this? You got two ocean and sand. I want to open. What is that? Is that beetles in there? Like the water beads? Yes. Two sand and beads. I'm gonna open it. Okay. All right. So Alana is. She saw these already. She's wondering if they're good. We're gonna open them right now. Julie just got them. She's just opening them. So we do not know. I call this company Farber Castle. I've been calling it that for I don't know years and years and years. And now I've discovered it's called what, Jewel? Faber Castell. Hashtag who knew? That's such like a New York thing because also Peg Perego is how we used to say that name, but then we mm -hmm. learned Peg Perigo, and then there's uh, Britax. Britax and Britax. Tomato, tomato. Kiko, Kiko. It's just <laughs> that bad. What's up with that? There's a lot of like baby, like juvenile products. With that, ones that you just know okay. We have enough problems. I don't have to take diction lessons. That's what happens. Jules, I want to open the outer space one first. Should we have everybody vote on which one? Oh, fine. Okay, space or C? Space. I'm kind of. I want space, so vote space. Space or C? Under the sea. So fish Under or sea. alien. Fish or alien. Fish or alien. I still. There may be fish on Mars. And then technical well, rocks would that be? We got the Perseverance. Pers Persevere. Perseverance. Is that the name of the Mars rover? Perspiration. Pers That's what I would call it. How many votes do we have? I'm seeing two. One for they each. Had, they had a they had to drive that thing there for seven months. I don't think I held my babies in my belly for seven months. <laughs> That's great, great. Okay. Oh, oh my God, the votes are coming in, Julie. It's wild. It's wild. It can't okay, I, think, I think space is winning. Oh, good. Thank you, everybody. Yay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. This is pretty easy to open. I think I might just be able to open it up with my thingies. Could you tilt this down a tiny bit? Yeah. Millie's over here as my son. She's going to be on the paper, too. I want to know what we're getting in here. Sure. So let me tell you. Okay. 99, by the way, guys. You want me to read the contents? Yes. What am I getting? The, the bin. bin. So, which is a nice bin. You can use this bin again. Space rockets. Net weight, 2.5 pounds. You get tongs, a scoop, an astronaut, a squishy alien, foam planets, glow-in-the-dark stars, oh. spirals, don't know what those are, sparkly pom-poms, and instructions. I can't wait. Rip it open. <laughs> Oh, it's got a piece on the side to make it easier to open one corner. Like the coleslaw yeah. containers. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking of. Coleslaw That's containers. How I know. Okay. All right. So we got a scoop and tongs. Could we take them out, Jewel? I will. Because I, I want you to tell me like, no. the quality. Part. I like that I can use this later to fish poops out of the bathtub. If I had a nickel. Who's ever had to do that? With some sort uh, of thing that came with a, a water table. I did. <laughs> and tongs for the, like, the little pieces you can't grab. 
Yes, that's good. I'm almost going to tears right now thinking about poop in the toilet, in the tub. Here we've got oh, some awesome pom-poms. Okay, I'm really getting into this. And then there's just these like thingies. Oh. Jewel, are those like the shoelace thingies? Yeah, Do but they're plastic. plastic. They're plastic, okay. They're plastic. This must be uh, the spirals that they mentioned okay. earlier. And then there's some glow in the dark stars. Okay. Like I used to have all these on my the roof of my um the ceiling of my bedroom when I was a kid. Oh man. Okay. So okay, now, now well, there's more. Wait, there's more. <laughs> I love Should we start our own university QVC show. <laughs> I feel like every time I do a live. <laughs> Jewel, how durable is he? But don't go too crazy. What's his name, Nat? His name is Mittens. <laughs> Mittens. He can dance. He can dance if you want. Ah! With inspiration. Jewel, Jewel, how tough is that little guy? How tough is it? Like on a scale of, oh, Julie, you're freaking me out. I know, I almost oh, ripped him But you need to know. I um, I'm afraid, Jewel. I would, say, I would say probably your three-year-old won't break it. Okay. Jen just said that the swirlies were like the keychain things. That's exactly what I was saying. That's exactly what they were. I used oh, to have one of those. Stand on it. Aaron's here. Aaron voted space too. Thank Yay. you. Yay. Okay, so what is he made of? Plastic. Plastic. Hard, Hard plastic. Uh, on something. Oh, both the arms move. Hey. What about legs? Oh. No. Feet? No. 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 Okay. Head? Well, arms. No. Okay. That's good. And then we have random foam thingies. Foam thingies, which could also be cute stamps. Yeah. Could also be reused in the bathtub. You could like get what I'm putting on, on the wall. The bathtub. All right. So there's lots of, lots of stuff. Let's put these yeah. on the side. Now, here's our little thingamajigger. Okay. Jewel, air and safety, does it say I have to dry out each time or could the, the content stay wet? Um, let's see. And is it wet? Um, it says wash the space rocks and accessories as needed with warm soapy water and air dry. Mm, okay. Sensory bin closed when not in use. That is okay. It, <laughs> like you wouldn't think, but you know. The space uh, rocks be picked up by a Roomba. Things we're going to find out this week. Probably. Oh, you got one? Jen got one. She made one for stuff at the Dollar Tree. So, oh, no, I didn't get a Roomba. I thought you meant you were in the comments. I was excited about your Roomba. I did not get a Roomba. My kids are fine. I have 16 year olds that are my Roomba. I go, sweep this house like that. Okay, I want to see what the space rocks are. They real rocks. Oh, this has a zip top. So that's good, so you can reuse it. Hold on. Oh, there's All a right. thing back in there. I'm sorry? Are they really going to get back in there, the space rocks? Well, we do have this thing that you could scoop them out and put them in the thingy. So maybe? Maybe. I probably would go for like a gallon Ziploc bag, like a hefty one. Okay. Not necessarily the brand name, but. Jewel, Lauren's on. She's watching from Emily's PT. Nice. All right, I'm opening this. Are you ready for the cascade? Okay. We, want it, we want it to be dramatic. Oh, you, that's where those went. Alec took the tongs. Ooh. Yeah. Hi. No, 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 no. Come on. We don't want Millie to eat these. Yes, yeah, she will. Oh, she's working on a gummies wrapper. All right. Alec, I need your help. Okay. Oh. We're getting him involved. Jiggle it. All right. All right. Alec is now going to play with this stuff. Okay. We want to. Yes. You know what his name is? Mitten. I'm going to eat his face. Man. Okay. Let him eat his face. I love Actually, this idea. It looks like he's picking. Alec, what do you think of the um why don't you put your hands in there? What do the rocks feel like? Hmm, I actually don't know. Here, if there's a scoop they thing. Feel rocky? Are they are they like rough around the edges? Like if you hold it in your hand. You feel, that's pretty cool. Let us see that. That's pre pretty cool. Turn it around. Look at see that you can see what we're doing there. Those are feet. This oh, is how it lands. He lands like that. Mm -hmm. I like it. It lands on their feet and brings them to earth. But make sure that their heads don't fall back down. That was a bad thing. Earth. But you know what? Mins is an ENT and could rescue. And he's still aliens teabagging him. That is the best part of my day. And thank you.
So, welcome, because you can't react to that, guys. You just gotta go. welcome to parenting. Okay, all right, let's go. What about those squiggly things? How many do we have? Four? Yes, how do those? Could you stretch those? Ooh, could you put water in that? I bet, yeah, Probably. I think you could. Because I feel like then that would be good to like sniff. These are your pants, buddy. All right, pour it back in there. Look at this. Uh, yeah, could you bury him? Is there enough rocks? Yes, there's very mittens. Mm. I'm going to call him banana. I'm going to call him. I'm going to call him. I just wasn't peeling it. Just wasn't peeling it. Can I tell a banana oh. joke? Can yes, great. That's a banana joke. Okay. You already heard a preview of it just now. Okay. I put a banana joke, but then he started crying. I guess he wasn't peeling it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you going to the top. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, wait, I want to see I want to see the beach one. Now, could you put the bin on that and so we can see the beach guy? All right, can you put all the stuff inside and then can you put this lid on? Alec, how old are you? Um, I'm eight. <gasps> eight. Having fun. Eight. All right, tell me now if you, God forbid that went sideways, Jewel. What did I do? If that if that goes sideways, is it staying put? <gasps> put it here. What? I'm worried. What if I turned it on its side, would it stay put? Yeah. Is it like a really good seal? <laughs> <laughs> this is bad. This is bad. Really, really, really. The fun never ends over here at the Nichols house. Okay. Yeah. Oh, good job, Alex. Put her somewhere. Really? 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 My? My girl? <laughs> turn it upside down, everybody. It says yes. that. I can't get his face off me. It's part of the fun. Uh, I blame the dog. I blame me, Mike. It's my fault. I said she made me turn it upside down. Yeah, Millie, there's someone outside for you. Oh, yeah, go throw a treat outside. Oh, my God. Anybody still watching this? Yeah. Erin Erin is laughing at my misfortune. We call that for you. All right, well. Mommy, I made a trail of treats. In the oh, that's so oh, smart. It's like riddled her. A trail of pepperoni. All right. It's really just the rocks on the floor. Oh, Here, man. Alec, I got a job for you. I'll give you a dollar if you pick all these up. I love it. I do that. Did you have bribes? Did you to open the mail for me? Ooh, he's using the scooper. Oh. To pick it up. Okay. Jewel, can you get an envelope in the mail for me today? Uh, I haven't checked the mail yet. So There's maybe. something for the kids in there. Oh, that's nice. So there you go. Let's see what's going on with this. Okay, let's see that one. Oh, my gosh. I get a switch. switch. Oh, my gosh. I'm, so, I'm really thirsty. I'm thinking I might go have a nice cup of tea later. Daddy? I'm not sure if I have enough tea bags. Daddy? I cannot eat. <laughs> you know, kids say the darndest things. Yeah, let them say that on, wasn't, whatever, we're not even going to remember that show. Um, Jules Verne, are yes. those beads supposed to be water beads? They're just straight up rocks, right? They're just straight up rocks, and I believe they are glow-in-the-dark rocks. Oh, let me read this again. No, it just says space rocks. Oh my gosh. So, I don't know if they glow in the dark, but the stars... Our glow in the dark. Okay. Well, that's good. So this might be fun to like expose to like a light source and then do this in the bedroom yeah. with the Oh, right. I love helpers. I love helpers. Okay. okay. I'm gonna spin this over a little bit. Okay. So this is the ocean. Okay. All right. 
I think that's pretty good. I think that's worth it. You want to play with this? Am I a horrible person to say that? I don't want to buy all those things. I think that's good for 20 bucks. For this is really good for 20 bucks. It would definitely cost you way more to buy all this stuff individually. Well, the thing is, I don't I don't want to go outside in public ever again. So <laughs> that's even my bigger problem. I mean, really, even if you were to buy all these things individually on Amazon or from a craft store online, like Michael's, like it would cost you at least thirty or forty dollars, I think. I don't know. I think it would be a bad idea. I have no idea. I just know the thing is that this is for ages three and up. If you were to try to buy all these things individually for age three and up, you're not you'd have to be very careful to make sure that all of those components were safe for three and up. You know what I mean? This is like, we know everything in the box. Oh, safety queen has been tested. Well, you know, I'm a safety girl. Yeah. Okay, so are they like fish tank gravel? Would you say fish tank gravelly or Mommy, snow? Look. Yes. Mommy, Let me hold them closer. What? I'm thinking to that and I caught them. You caught them. Yeah. Okay. That's great. I like the pink. Well, let's play yeah, there's play. pink, blue, and blue, black. I like the moon rock. You can put this down here. Oh, you want? He wants to open the new one. Okay. So here's the ocean. Another. Oh, two more. Great. Oh, yeah. My, 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 I don't Toys. They look a lot like the tub toys we have. So these are the bathtub toys. They're not the same ones. Well, they're similar. No, they're actually the same they're one. Literally except the same. The rest. They're actually the same toys. Except some of them are different. Got it. It's the same. Okay. Go in there. And then we have more. We have these little guys who are like tiny little um, sand toys to make molds. They're like oh, yeah. sand molds. Yes. Michelle. Oh. A little crab, a little lobster, and then you can put the thing in some very Boston up. Up in a turtle. There's Push a bunch of them. Okay, hold on a second, Alec. We gotta go through all this stuff. All right, and then we got these. We got a what is this, Alec? Uh hammerhead shark. Yes, hammerhead shark. I was waiting for that. And then we've got <laughs> this is a whale, a crab, a seal, and an octopus. Oh wait, and we got a gold turtle. Is it really an octopus? Is this an octopus or a squid? It's it's an octopus, octopus, right? Yeah. Squids are squids are those things with tentacles and one eye. No. So you guys, real rocks. Real rocks. Real rocks. Those are nice rocks. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is the a big block of sand. Why is there more? Okay. Let's just take that out. Let's hold the sand in the bag. You sure. I think maybe that is a good idea. Okay. This is sick. No, we'll take it out. It's fine. Okay. We'll be real careful. Mommy, it, can make it can make it. Oh, don't put your feet in there, honey. No, no, honey. There's. <laughs> Guys, this is life. This is video life. And this I'm is just. Me. Now we also have dog hair involved in the. Oh, uh, yes. 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 Dog hair in face. <laughs> Let's open it. I want to pull it. Okay, this actually had a little tab, so you were able to just rip it open. I didn't notice it, so I was already. Uh, so that was nice. I want to pull it. Well, I'm going to pour it with you. One, two, three. Yeah, it's like baking a oh, trip. You don't have to hit it hard. This, can you tell this is my sensory boy? The box is made for him. Oh, okay. it's good. So happy. All right. You want to play with that? You play with that. You'll push that more. Yes, yes, yes. I want to see that kind of. Like, is it like that in the sand, or is it like playground sand? Tell her what you think it's like. Oh, it's magnet sand. It, it feels like kinetic sand. Kinetic sand. Okay. Got it. Yeah. So, Got and that, like, kinetic sand is really, in case you don't know what kinetic sand is, it's like sand that just kind of, like, sticks together more. Okay. It, it falls apart more. It falls apart, and then it kind of clumps together, so it's not, like, all loose. It has, like, it, like it's firmer. And it like holds together better. See, like it actually holds together. It's got a it's bit like of moisture. It's like a blob of slime. Oh. It's like a blob of slime, but sand. Like a blob of slime, but sand. Okay, this this bag of rocks, I did need a scissors to open it. I just want to look right now. So I know that we're seeing the outer space, the ocean, and sand. They uh -huh. all have construction zone, dinosaur dig, and garden and critters. And um. These, where's the thing? Okay, these are water beads. Those are the so, Okay. 
Have an adult gently empty the bag of sensory sand into one half of the bin. Arrange the rocks along the edge of the sand and separate it from the water beads. Slowly place the water beads on the empty side of the bin using the blue scoop. Water beads bounce, so be careful. Open and arrange all other items in your bin. Now it's time to scoop, play, and create while engaging your senses. So do I have to add water to this? Yes, and it, they will blow up. Okay. Oh, there, the instructions are on the other side. Okay. Add three cups of cool tap water to a large bowl. Add in the water beads. Okay. Should I, you want me to go do that? Do you want to go do that? Yeah. I, I would not. Okay, Alec, entertain the people. Show them how they play Wait, with the no, no, I want to see, like, when you do the, the shell, I want to see if the imprint goes into the sand. All right. Could you show her the, the um, there you go. See, Alec, he's, already, he's on his way to being a YouTuber. He might as well be a Facebook Liver as well. <laughs> Maybe I can get into YouTubing and live streaming. Okay, we're live streaming right now, my love. Oh. <laughs> we are? Cool. We are. Okay, let me see. Hold it down a little bit more to the camera because that's how live streamers do it. Okay, now, handsome, if you get it out of there, does it stay the imprint of the lobster? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Look at that, little fella. Okay, can you see the crab one? Is there a crab one too? Uh, we have a lobster, a turtle, oh, a snake one. Oh, a starfish, crab. Starfish, starfish, starfish. Starfish, crab. I want, I want three starfishes next to each other. Octopus. Oh wait, let me see the octopus. Oh, and dolphin. I'm getting too excited. I'm over. Right. So here's. Something that I wish I had known before, but now we know. It takes about three hours for these water beads to expand. Hysterical. <laughs> Good times. Well, Set the bin aside while you assemble the bin. Okay, so we'll we'll be back on at uh you know nine o'clock tonight. <laughs> I love it. We'll be back maybe tomorrow. We could check now. We'll check now in a few days. You just have fun and play with this. I would like to see the octopus. Um as well. The starfish came out good. Can you show the octopus that uh, Okay. I, you know that that's my favorite creature? My favorite creature is a T-Rex. Is it? Then yes. you would like that dinosaur one. Yes, I will. They have a dinosaur one. It's like, it's dinosaur dig, and it has like um a volcano, and it has a tree. But I don't think that it has, it's got the sand like yours does. Like that. I'm looking right now at the dinosaur one. Oh, it's got a dinosaur egg. Hey, listen, you know what mommy could do? Mm. Because mommy's the queen, she could actually turn this into a dinosaur one for you. Mm. Let me tell you, something, but you could go get your tiny dinosaurs and you could bring anybody from your room, as long as mommy says it's okay, to go into there. And so you could, you could totally turn that into like a little terrarium. Ooh, I like this idea. Oh, I just use what you got. That's oh, the octopus, I love him. Keep the sand in the bin. That's the only problem. I would say anytime you're using a sensory bin, especially if you've never done it before, if there's materials in there that could really mess up your house, pick like a good spot. I mean, ideally outside, but you know, clearly it's winter most places right now. Um, but if you do it, do it at like a big kitchen table, maybe put like plastic down on the floor, <laughs> maybe put like a tablecloth you don't care about on top of the table and maybe put the, you know, something over their clothes, like maybe some sort of, you know, smock. Well, this, I think the sand, Jewel, do you think that they still need uh, the sand or is it dry? Ooh, look. He made a um a starfish, buddy. I'm telling you, Mr. Starfish is the best. I do want to know how the beads go with that, if and when it's time. Just report. No, so the idea. Where do all the rocks go? Are they under here? Oh, so you're supposed to make like a wall of rocks. Okay. Separate the sand from the beads is the idea. But then you know, as what usually happens with most sand and water tables, they all get mixed together and it makes a big mess. Yes. So I would say kids that like are like really good about keeping things what? neat would really do well with this. Mommy, one. wait. Mommy, what? Yeah. Ooh, that's a cute little crab. Sensory bins. They have a lot of crab on top of crab. Oh, that's crab on top of 
Well, I put the links up so you guys can literally are 1999, which is really nice. Are they put on top of a crab on top of a crab? All right, I like it. the one here. That's the link. That's an affiliate link telling you. Let's wait. Um, but I would definitely go check those out. Thank you very much Yay. To, uh, to our wonderful it's I can use this. Nano White. This is what he's going, you guys. I'm telling you, the best 20 bucks I didn't spend, but I would have <laughs> if they hadn't sent it to me <laughs> to try it out. I would. Yeah, this is awesome. And that genetic sand that really stays jewel, like when you're picking it up from the table, is it easier, obviously? Than it is easier to gather it together because it's kinetic sand. Yes, absolutely. And, you know, for for more than one kid, definitely get one per kid. Yeah, I'm seeing that now. I think and can just get one for the both of them to play because the box isn't, like, big enough. Yeah. But since it's only 20 bucks, I yeah. mean. Jewel, would you get two of the same or would you get two different? Uh, I would get two different and then I would rotate them. Okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I love that pillow, by the way. With that bee in it. I don't think I saw that. Buzz, buzz, this buzz. is from my uh father in law's house. This is about oh, a business. I love it. There you go. I like it. Thank you for showing us your new fun stuff. Wanna say goodbye, Alec? And what do you want to say? Bye, my nerd. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This is what you want to do for a living. Give us well, have just another live stream. <laughs> I trained them well over here. You did good, Joel. You did go with that one. That's it. He's going to have to support us in our old age. <laughs> oh, he wants the next generation. I don't think gin is going to get any cheaper. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much to not Faber Castle because that's not how you say it, Jewel. How do you say it again? Faber Castle. Still, and it's, their line is called Creativity for Kids. That's all their kids. There's stuff. a ton of stuff, by the way. I had no idea they had that much stuff. Oh my God! Let me just quickly grab the other things they sent me. What else did they send you? Oh my God! They sent me three more things. <laughs> well, one of them is in my mother's house right now, which was the terrarium. <gasps> That's what I want, the terrarium. And so here's a paint for studio. Oh, paint for studio. Paints and a paint board, got, paint station, a bunch of paint stuff. The dead this, this is really cute, a rock painting kit. Rock painting kit, yes. Which is really nice because trying to find rocks that are paintable is really hard. Like finding them on the ground. That's not $14.99. Is that the glow in the dark one, Jules? Yes. Oh, the terrarium is where it's at for me. Also $14.99. Loving the terrarium. Yay. Mommy, they have a lot of awesome one, kits. Mommy, which one? Mommy, which one does Bubby have? She has the terrarium. Which one's the terrarium? Is your mom doing it or are the kids doing it? We have like a jar with um plants that you can grow inside of it. Well, be kind of like that whitey bunk spoon in kindergarten. We like took some where they took some uh, uh ladybug eggs and and every day we can look at them and see how they grow and eventually once they and eventually once they go we let the butterflies out. Yes, yes, from the chrysalis says it. Well, a chrysalis experiment in kindergarten. Yeah, I think a terrarium would be an appropriate uh thing to put growing uh butterfly slash caterpillar i love it all right i just want to note he's got his feet inside the other bin because this is my sensory boy he loves putting his feet on the rocks for the the, the moon landing whatever this is the space one just glad he likes it oh also fun fact the moon is made of cheese i love cheese i wonder i love the moon so much because i love cheese I so like that's a lot or a Harvardi. I prefer a nice goat. I like a good goat cheese. I don't know. Is it too many craters? It's got to be something with holes. Oh, true. I right. don't tell you. Turn the back. Turn it. Turn the back. Did you guys want to say bye so you could go back to plan? No, like down. Okay, thank you. Good job. Feel free to make me 8,000 videos of these, my love. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, don't forget to buy my merch. <laughs>
And hit the notification bell to never miss another live stream. That was my point. Until next time, we will see you. Thank I you. Want my tail. Great little sensory bin. See you later. Jules, say bye to everybody. <laughs>